Me. Who we got here? One. One. We've got one folks here. Let's see here. Two folks. Okay, so I want to show you guys something really quick. I'm just going to do a quickie video here. Oh, one person left. You guys hear me okay? Can you guys hear me okay? Hello? Okay, so here they come. All right. Hey, guys. So I um, just want to show you something really quick. Uh, it's Saturday morning, and I am just kind of out in the lawn. And I want to do a little bit of work, but um, I got something to show you. So just I'm going to wait for just a couple more people to come in. My dahlias are coming in um, good, actually. I want to show you that really quick. So check this out. Check that guy out. So that's like that big. It's a big one. We got lots of blooms here. Uh, lots of buds ready to come. It's kind of cool. Really happy about that. Nothing here yet. Nothing here yet. And then over here, we got one coming in right here. Like that dark color. Pretty cool. So, anyways, and then got another one over here. Got lots of dahlias through here starting to come. Check this guy out. That one's about ready to bloom. That's way overgrown, needs to be cut back. And then I've got one over here, right here. I think this one could be white lightning. I'm not exactly sure which one this one is. Hit the like button, people, he says. Okay, so that's not what I want to show you. So this is what I want to show you, okay? Okay, so over here, I'm doing a, uh, actually, let me just turn this around. Some of you got diarrhea. See this? I've been working on this for the past few days, and I've been using my drag, which is over here. See this? Been pulling it around with my four wheeler. It's about ready to seed. I'm just about ready to plant the grass over here. Okay. And the reason this is all looking like this is because the four wheeler came through here and I was dragging this and it was pulling material onto the lawn. It looks pretty bad, but look at this. So I left this last night. Okay. Left this last night and it didn't look like that at all. And. Looks like somebody came through at 1.50 in the morning and decided to flip a U-turn right there. And, um, <laughs> you guys, man. So somebody decided just to flip a U-turn right here and drove right through the mud. The reason it's wet is because I was trying to figure out if I had good sprinkler coverage before I plant the seed. And so that's what, that's what that happened. So... <laughs> Uh, it's just you just can't win you know people just want to drive wherever they're lazy they don't want to do a three-point turn so they just this is what you wake up to which pretty much sucks but what do you do you know i did see the security camera footage and it looks to me like it's uh it was uh like a suburban or something like that i mean come on people so anyways, I was wanting to plant this and then I was going to come out here this morning and plant this. I kind of needed to wait until it was all um, kind of dried out so I could smooth it out. It was actually all smooth last night, ready to go. Looks like I got a low spot right there. I just needed to rake out some of the this stuff right here and kind of get rid of some of this, uh, some of these rocks and, and such right here. But I came out today and I was totally deflated. It just things were not good and I was not happy. I saw that and I was just like pretty pissed. So, kind of sucks. So anyways, that's that guys. I am sorry to tell you that I did not get much of any footage about this process, but I have my camera out today and I was going to film myself or film getting this area seated. But, 
Now we got that to deal with, which really sucks. So I don't know if you guys know, but Ryan Nor was here last week on the 4th, last Saturday. And he and I spent some time mowing the lawn here. The lawn kind of looks a little bit stressed out because I put some MSM on there and trying to kill some of that uh, ryegrass on there. You know what my wife said to me? She says, the, what, the lawn's never looked as good as it did before you killed the lawn. So she's like, you need to put the ryegrass back in there. And that likely will happen someday. Uh, probably next season. I don't know. I do love the ryegrass, but I just think it's for sissies. I do love it though. It's the most beautiful grass that you that you've ever seen. Who we got here? Hey. Okay. Anyways, I don't want to take any more of your time. Just wanted to give a quick update as what I've got going on. The white picket fence is never going to work, and I am going to put some of those reflector poles there. And then once I seed it, I'm going to put a little little caution fence, little tape thing. So I'm going to get my triplex out and mow the lawn. Hey, uh, the grass factor, Matthew Martin, I do love you guys. You guys are the best. If you guys haven't um, seen uh, Matthew Martin's channel, he's the grass factor on the YouTubes. He has a radio show called Turfs Up Radio. If you just go to Turfs Up Radio, he does a like a two-hour show every Monday through Friday on turfsupradio.com he's a guest host so he plays music there and we chat and it's it's a it's a good time so the reflector pulls like the gcf turf that is likely what i'm going to do that's why that uh, t post is over there see that t post right there that is the reason that's there is to prevent people from driving over the corner and i take it down when i mow so i'm about to get my triplex out here I'm going to do some mowing, but that, that there, I tell you, that just, that really pisses me off. So, the beds are looking really good. I've got good color, and my dahlias are starting to bloom finally, and they've turned, it's turned out really good. So, I love you guys. I'm going to let you guys go. Spike strip on the T-Po, so that's a good idea. More blooms about to come here on my dahlias. What about the hat? Um, yeah, I just I just made up this hat. Or on my website, if you're interested. Anyways, I love you guys. Hopefully I can get some good footage of this tonight, and then hopefully I will be able to edit it tomorrow and get it up for you guys. So no, no I don't want to stay live. I got to, um, I got to work. I'm going to get out my triplex and mow it. So, love you guys. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys uh, in the next video. Hopefully, I just put up two videos early this morning. Just me kind of down at the greenhouse. And then I've got some footage with Ryan Knorr that I plan to, uh, that I plan to edit. And then I'm going to do some filming today. I'm going to get out my triplex and mow this. And i got to wait for that to dry out before I can kind of fix it. And there, so Alaska, oh man, I want to come to Alaska so badly. I, w I would love, I want to go up there so badly. So anyways, you guys are awesome. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video or I'll see you guys later. So this is also going dark. I'm not going to put this up there. I don't like the live videos being on there. See you later.